Hello, sir. <laughs> How are you? Don't eat my finger. I need that. Ow. I got paint on it from Carter. <laughs> Were you a good boy today? Yeah. Oh, you need extra loving? What happened? Was Gus Gus mean to you? I find that hard to believe because I think you were the Henri one. Was Ziggy mean to you? Oh, it was Ziggy. That's funny. Look, Gus Gus is like, uh, I'm not the mean one. I'm not the chaser here. It is, in fact, been known that you, Oki, are the chaser. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you for the kiss. Thank you for the kissy. Thank you. What? You don't have to kiss me. Kiss Gus. Tell him you're sorry. Kiss Gus Gus and tell him you're so sorry. You think that's possible? Corny, I'm not kissing you today. Oh, that's not Gus. That's Corny. He doesn't want to kiss you. Corny, kiss him. He wants a kiss. Oh. Okay, you're handing out kisses to the wrong folks. Gus Gus is that guy right over there, and I think that you must have made him mad. He heard his name, and he was like, yeah, Okie's been chasing me everywhere. Your tail wags when I say that. When I say, Okie's been chasing me everywhere. No? You can control it now? You can't control it. <laughs> Lucky, corny. Okie just wants a kissy poo. Can you do that for him? Okie, not everybody likes kisses, okay? He's like, but Cornholio is making the kissing noise. He's making a poof, poof. He's not blowing kisses. Okie has a little lesson to learn here. Oh boy. <laughs> Corny, be sweet to him. He's just a little boy. He's just a tiny little lad. Yes, he is. He doesn't need to learn that hard of a lesson. Thank you. Thank you for just making him run. Oh, he's running back to his daddy and his daddy's being mean. Ernest, you have twigs hanging from you like all over the place. Come on, Ernie. Whoa! Oh no, that's really stuck. I tried, buddy. Let me get the one off your chest at least, please. Okie just walked by and did a flying sidekick, and I don't think that my video caught it. But that stick is really stuck in Ernie's tail. That's no good. Let's get the one off your chest. Oh. <sighs> Let's get that. Oh, he stinks. Why do boys smell bad? I'm so glad that you don't smell bad yet. Ernest. <clears throat> Ernie, just let me have that thing off your chest. Come on. It helps to get things off your chest. That was not a really a punny. It was kind of punny. Okay, go back to eating. Oki's like, Dad, she's cool. She's totally cool. You want me to spray you? It's a hot day, isn't it? Will that help you? Here. You want me to spray? Oh, that feels good, huh? It's pretty hot for an alpaca today. Who's got their full winter coat on. So Ernie's all in here. I'm not gonna spray Oki. But if Ernie lets me spray him, then he'll come close to me. So I can get get it off his chest. Literally. I gotta change this water anyway. Let me dump this out. And we'll get started. All right, well, as suspected, Ernest was interested in my water situation. I was able to get the one off his chest, but that one in his tail is gonna require a cut of his hair, not of his tail. You're, sir, you're standing on this very So, we'll get him all showered down here. I don't know. I'll probably end up saving that project for tomorrow, but it's gonna need two people, and Lester's not here right now. Which is fine. He's got one on his back, too. What did you get into, sir? All right. I have to put this down, and I'll show you in a second what we got accomplished. 
Okay, so I got the one off of his back. It had a whole bunch of thorns in it. I don't know what he's rolling in out around the pond or what bush he got into, but it's stuck in his tail. So tomorrow, when Lester comes with me, we'll get him cornered and just get that clipped out. It won't be a big deal. It won't require any, like, massive hold down. It'll just be real quick. What do y'all want? I put out grain. I put out hay. I did. And now, thank you, Cornelio. I did. And then I'm going to fill this up. And then it's back to Longhorn Lester for more chores. Yay!